My name is Jeff Staple. We are driving right now into the beautiful state of New Jersey. Um, I'm the founder and creative director of a company called Staple Design, which is now on karmaloop.com. Uh, in the co-pilot seat in the back, we have Courtney Walker, head designer for Staple. And today we're gonna enlighten you on something we know very much about. We are very educated about this topic, and that is the hamburger. We're gonna visit some uh, secret burger spots that you might not be familiar with. Um, decided to leave our cozy habitats of New York City where you know you can sort of find your your everyday popular burger spots and we're going to take you in the cut to where we came from in New Jersey. Correct me if I'm wrong Courtney, but this is pretty much perfect picture perfect postcard typical New Jersey. This is Wonder Years suburbia. <laughs> One, this is Wonder Years to a T. When you watch the movie Big, if you've seen the movie Big and Tom Hanks is going back home in his yeah. suit and jumping up, right. this is the street. Right. This is where we are. Like it's not weird to see dead possums or like a deer a just deer. on the side, side exactly. of the road. So we we're, we're in Westwood, New Jersey right now. About 30 minutes, a 30 minute nice easy drive outside of uh, Manhattan. And we're headed to a place called the Iron Horse, which neither of us have been to before, but I've heard really good things about it. We've arrived at the Iron Horse. As you can see, established 1972. So this place is very old, old, old older old than tavern. both of us. This definitely. is where your old uncle yeah. would take you to share war stories. Yeah. While the war was happening, yeah. probably, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. We're about to have an old burger, to say yeah. the least. So let's see, uh, let's see what we have in store. Let's this is go. good. I have uh, very high hopes about this place, you know? I think when you walk into a restaurant, like, there's many, like, ambiance cues that sort of, like, give you an idea of what you're in store for. I have very high hopes here. They're not kidding when it's stuff because it doesn't look like it's a cheeseburger. But I don't know about yours, but mine has cheese like oozing out like a zit. Can I ask you a question? Sure. Do you have like a is it is there like a cheese syringe that like injects no, the cheese what in? No, they do is they take the hamburger, yeah. meat, and they right open. They put that. The cheese has got to be you know, shredded first. Okay. And they put the cheese in the middle, and then they reform the hamburger. Oh. And, and then it melts on the inside. It melts on the inside. It changes the whole flavor. Wow. I've never had it. When you bite into it, it's just like. <laughs> you don't even know what the burger tastes like yet. You don't know if it needs mayo or not, but yet you're just blindly putting mayo on the whole bun. You know what, Jeff? Like, I we just made a decision. To, uh, fuck. You're speaking from prejudice, because you're not a sauce guy. <laughs> this is my friend. So I'm saying, hey, friend, nice to see you again. We're about to go on this journey again. Someone a long time ago in this kitchen decided this was the way the burger should be. <laughs> I'm going to respect his wishes and have one bite this way first. Look at that. Oh, God. This is a great motherfucking burger. The bun, super simple, perfect. Doesn't interfere with the burger. Oh, it's so tasty. I wish I was a food expert so I can explain exactly how good it is. <laughs> the Iron Horse, real deal. We came to this restaurant. We obviously ordered something that's a home run, right? Now, if you were to come back to this restaurant multiple times, mm -hmm. are you the type of eater that will try different things and sway, or will you always go to the solid thing? If I love it, yeah, you won't you won't sway. I'm not gonna mess up my experience. This is a work of art that is now finished. I'm sad. All right, first you got the burger. Yeah. Second your size. And yeah. Your third, your, your drink. Your okay. Beverage. All right. I'll get the LA burger and then we'll share a little bit. So I'll, I want to try your Dallas, but okay. And my favorite side is the beer batter and your All right. I love sure the beer batter. All right, let's do it. We started about four o'clock. The grand Jupiter, the dog. I kind of like the concept that Bobby did here, where like he brought the concept of like high cooking gourmet style burgers to like the masses. You know. Usually don't get like this kind of cooking. Yeah. Right next to a mall. He took a very he took a very simple concept and took the high road. Brought a little boutique flavor to it. Yeah. We're back again. Courtney Walker, 
Jeff Staple here. We are now in, uh, I don't know, where are we now? Hackensack, New Jersey? Hackensack, yeah. Hackensack. Hackensack. And we're at the third and final stop of our burger tour of the Garden State of New Jersey. White Man is like a staple in Hackensack. Yeah. Any burger aficionado, if they have come to New Jersey and have not had White Mana, yeah. they didn't have a burger. And this will be an interesting mix between what we've had. We've had Bobby's Burger Palace, which is like PDP. boutique in a mall. We had the Iron Horse, legendary, old school. Very sort of tavern-y, Yeah, tavern, tiny. pub, steakhouse. Yeah. And now we've got literally like a roadside, run-of-the-mill shack. Yes, this is the shack now. When I'm in White Manor, there's a certain reverence that I have. Like when you look at the lady actually making the burgers and flipping them and seeing the, the art that goes into the bun. She puts the bun on top of the burger. Like there's a certain juiciness that the bun has to have as well. Like you don't just get a dry sort of like bun. They don't just do a burger on the grill and then slap it on a, a dry bun. And people in here are sort of like at church. Like there's a certain quiet like church-like reverence to like the, the preacher. Yes. <laughs> You just notice the difference in ambiance yeah. between like Bobby's Burger and this place. Like Bobby's was like loud music playing, you know, like rambunctious. This place is, even though it's way older, it's like very, very serene in here. All right, so you just went on a nice burger tour of uh, the state of New Jersey with us. Again, I'm Jeff Staple from Staple Design. Courtney Walker, head designer of Staples, behind me. Uh, we just took you on a nice little tour of three great spots that we really love in the state of New Jersey. Um, thanks a lot to Karma Loop TV for, for taking the ride with us and uh, allowing us to document this and share it with you. Um, we hope you like what we're doing. Check out the line, uh, stapledesign.com. We're also on Karma Loop. Um, and that's it. We'll see you next time. Hopefully we'll do uh, pizzas next. Yeah. Peace.